What's an escalation addendum? Hey, Bella, do you know what an escalation addendum is? Huh? Huh? Hey guys, I'm Richie Hanna with Remax Gateway. Today we're talking about escalation addendums, the pros and cons, and how it works. So pretty much, we've got a home that's listed for $750,000. We call the listing agent, say, hey, what's going on? You got multiple offers? How can I help? What are the sellers looking for? And she goes, hell yeah, we've got multiple offers on this property. I recommend you put your best foot forward. We're gonna have a deadline Monday at 5 p.m., okay? So we go, okay, we literally like the house. We're gonna offer $10,000 over list price. Plus, we're gonna add an escalation addendum. Yes, an escalation addendum that's gonna increase the price. And the way an escalation addendum works is we're gonna write in there, in a figure, how much we're willing to beat another offer by and what our absolute max price is. So we're willing to beat another offer by $5,000 up to $775,000. Now let's talk about the pros and cons about this, okay? Pros are, they gotta show proof of a bona fide other offer. So if there was an escalation and it triggered to this higher number, the sellers have to provide proof of the other offer to make sure all terms, or at least price point, comes out to netting the seller the same dollar amount. Shows buyers you mean business. You know, you're putting your mouth where your money is, or your money where your mouth is, and you're putting on paper, shows that you mean business to the seller, okay? And then less back and forth negotiations. Instead of going back and forth, raising the price every five, $10,000, you're pretty much putting on paper, like we're gonna willing to beat the price by this, and this is our max price, okay? Now the cons about an escalation addendum. The one big thing that we've seen that can hurt your negotiation power is you're exposing your max price. You're pretty much telling the seller, hey, this is exactly how high I'm willing to go, and I feel comfortable paying that price, okay? What if there's another escalation? Well, that's called double triggering of an escalation. So if you got two escalation addendums going to 775 and we're only at 760, boom, they both trigger each other all the way to the 775 instantly. So you can automatically go to your escalation price very quickly when you've got one or more escalation addendums involved on the same deal. And then seller seeks the higher price. They know this is what you're willing to offer. They're getting greedy. They see the numbers. Now they want the higher price and they start wanting to negotiate from this number here, okay? As we know, price and terms are the winner, right? There's a lot more to price when it goes to winning and providing a compelling offer. It goes down to earnest money deposit. How quickly can you close? What type of contingencies you have, all right? It's not all about the money. So hope you guys found this helpful. Please feel free to reach out with any questions. Let me know I could be of service to you. And remember, I'm never too busy for your referrals. Have a great day.